Hello everyone and welcome back for a new episode of Let's Play Our Adventure Guild on Absolute Max Difficulty. This is no name. And as I mentioned in a previous video, I've rewatched my previous playthrough during the Arena quest. And I came to the conclusion that it was a must-do quest due ASAP due to the um, traits I could get from it. Uh, the traits are easily obtainable as the highest skill check was 40. Now it will be 60 due to our difficulty setting, uh, which is sorry this one, attribute check modifier plus 50%. Uh, I don't think uh, the difficulty check will be also related to the doom clock at least i hope it won't but even though ilan has been saving some strength growth and some level growth before i want because i want him to turn to a dragon knight first and same thing for raymond they should both be able to reach a 60 skill check especially since wrath is with them and will grant them a nice 30% of 46 willpower bonus, which will mean plus 15, plus 16 maybe, depending on rounding. And so I should be able to get all those new traits. And regarding the fights, I have to be careful. Uh, and I will also get a nice rope for um, Endors, who is still sitting with a kind of meh. Uh, high mage robe and he doesn't have a lot of HP so having that good robe would be good for him and so let's jump right into it past glory does he want to talk to a falcon? no, alright past glory All right. Is there anything else I would like to equip? Oh, I'm stupid. I should do this. There is no reason for me to have you keep that one. Yep. Hmm. Right. Let's start this awesome quest. Minus 20 SP cost of boss kill is huge. Alright, uh, this is for resisting damage, I think, so I'm gonna do it with you. Oh shit, 60 with power. I can't do that one. <laughs> well, I can try three times. Ah, the rolls are not that bad, but not good enough. I should have tried with Wrath. Oh, 
I should have checked better my previous. I checked that one, but I didn't see the previous one. Let's see what did I miss. Ten percent damage reduction. Shit, that would be huge. Ah, mine of a body. Well, that's part of the deal, that's part of Iron Man. I don't have mine of a body. Uh, prepare first. Should I take some potion with you because... So let's see... You have... You're taking potion like this works, alright. I am disappointed for mine of a body. Roth could have used this, but yeah. Would have been that great on him. If I, I should have turned Ilan into a Dragon Knight first, that would have solved the issue. That's unfortunate. I will write this. Alright, so... Okay, none of you are a threat. Ah, interesting, I can have two free turns. Well, one free turn. No, you can charge, so you are a threat. So let's see. I am going to Can I pin you if I go there? No. I should have played this first, never mind. And those beginners do some damage. Right? Oh shit! I didn't see that one coming. Throw knife.
60 chance, 60 damage. Oh. Alright, we'll finish this on next turn. Okay, let's use this one now in during that fight so that everyone has higher BP for next fight. Yeah, let's secure that kill. That's unfortunate. Really unfortunate. So this one is against the monks. Alright, let's see, what do you have? Opening strike, back attack, you're the earth one. Okay, four range, your earth as well, you are earth as well. All of them are Earth? Alright. Okay, none of these guys can charge. So... Oh no, sorry, they can move 
and then strike two tiles away. Yes, so I cannot wait with you, nor with you. My bad. If I put the decoy here... What's the decoy range? Yes, that will distract them. Let's do empower first and we'll do SP and BP next uh, next turn. Okay, let's TP there for maximum damage. Let's put a trap here because one of you will go off. I have to remember that I now I have to strike immediately. I just lost 20% damage. Wait. Damage reflection works. Oh, I really thought damage reflection worked only on melee, which is clearly not the case here. Oh, that backfired. Oh shit, if I knew I wouldn't have chosen the, f the fire enhancement because it <laughs> it doubles the reflection effect. Fuck. So, wait. Um, let's summon Pikachu over there. And let's obviously heal you first. there Okay, I don't want those guys to burn because otherwise that might trigger some more damage back to me.
Wow, that is absolutely not I s how I saw that quest going. Alright. Let's go A, P, N, what? S, P for everyone. Okay, I have a few potions to drink. And let's give everything we've got on that last one. Okay, let's be careful. What do these guys have in store? Kester has 700 HP. Terran, the Paladin, 900. 770. Okay, let's see. Paladin, Arcanite, Ranger. The Bard, High Mage. Ooh! The Assassin and the Ranger play before us. 50 initiative. Okay, let's see. Let's take things calmly. You play first. Okay, you have permal stealth. Potentially. Five movements. Epic enemy, all right. Okay. Increase the BP cost of adventurous brave action by 25%. Indeed. Alright, that's new. Okay, you have protector twice. Passive true sight, like everyone else. Seems like a bug. Okay, so if I can kill the Paladin, things would be better. Okay, fuck. That's gonna hurt. We can only play songs for you, I can leave you safe. But 
but for the you have true sight, so getting invisible would be useless. Okay, you can hit anywhere on the map. So you're a lightning master. And earth master as well. So I may want to use some decoy for everyone. Not too close so that you don't strike it. But you play last, okay. So you probably won't come that close. I will come to you first. So, what is the strategy here? Probably to burn through all I have ASAP. Yep. Let's go all in. Who should I kill first? Probably you, even though you're the hardest to kill. Because you would slightly make your friends All allies. It doesn't count. Actually, you may not be the hardest to kill because the other one I have 20% damage reduction now, but not you. What do you have? Yeah. And you don't have that. So, let's start with the Paladin first. Then you before you turn fully invisible. You what's your damage output? 120. Oh fuck. Alright. So I will play. I have four plus six. I will have 10 AP, I will cast this, this, and power, and I will have two left. Okay, that will be the decoy. But if I play like this, question becomes, where do I put the decoy for it to be useful? Okay, the decoy will mostly serve as a proxy for people in the back line. Let's see this like this. Alright. We'll do this. Yeah, we're gonna succeed that one. Okay, so I do want to TP there, to be close enough to everyone. And to be able to target you. Let's start like this.
How is it I do on me? Okay. I'm still gonna kill probably the mage and the bard first. Minus one. Minus two. I shouldn't have done that. I focused on the Paladin because now I'm doing some AoE. Let's go Inferno. That's what it takes guys to fight the Adventurer Guild. Oh yes, it costs 12. Oh shit. Cast this. Put some on the angel here. She will cast Rage and Blast. Let's have you finish like this. Whoa! So I'm just sad I didn't get the damage reduction on Elan. That's too bad. But that's part of Iron Man permadeath. Alright, so now people are a bit injured. That is normal. Alright, that was a nice quest. Let's do some alchemy upgrades. I can craft some nice Various new potions now. No new worthy assignments. I'm still 
still disappointed to not have the dragon hunting story quest for our beloved Ilan. So I think tomorrow we'll do the third disciple and we will see if we jump right into the next story quest which is the burn the witch one or if we do a few quests before days 105 to level up our guys a little and wait for the dragon to show up and only then do the witch We will see. Well, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed this very interesting arena quest because it was much harder than I would have anticipated. It's changed a lot since early access or at least since my previous playthrough. And that was way harder than I expected. I'm getting... I really feel that the difficulty setting is right where it needs to be. Well, I said that in a previous uh, playthrough, it was way easier, obviously. At least, I would say, eight times easier. But so far, yeah, it's getting really, really interesting. Well, as always, hope you enjoy. Uh, please feel free to comment, share, whatever, like, uh, do whatever you want with this video. And see you soon for the next episode, guys. Take care. Cheers.